All right, let's do some mini painting. This is on a Bones 5 Hydra. We're not doing start to finish. This is just for some background. If you're working, if you're just hanging out, just a little bit of miniature painting. We've sped it up so we can get through and have this under 35 minutes. This Hydra from Reaper is with their Bones 5 Kickstarter. And I had the idea for this miniature based off of green snakes. So, a little challenging because of the way this Hydra snake body is in the base. But I think overall it's a pretty good sculpt. I really like the details on it. And I think it's going to be a great miniature to be able to use on the table. There's definitely a lot of opportunity to use this as both a hydra as well as just something you can homebrew for a giant snake to terrorize your players should you so choose. And again, this concept here I came out it's going to be green with some white spotting or striping along the back. Should be pretty interesting. One of the big things I think with the Bones 5 Kickstarter was just the wide assortment of miniatures. So many good sculpts. You can see this one here with the integrated base. It's decorative. You don't have to do a base for it. It's set for three inch base and overall came out really, really well. The plastic of the bones held the details really well. So I think the formula that they're using in their plastic is much improved from the early Bones versions. And the details from the mouth and eyes all the way to the scales, just really, really well done. That's true of a lot of the Bones miniatures. Of course, on our Twitch channel, Every Tuesday night, you're going to be opening a Bones, doing some assembly, and rating it. And then we'll try to do some painting of the miniatures as well. They're on Twitch. Those videos will get recorded so we can upload them here to our YouTube channel as well. And it should equate to some good content. If you are in the hobby of miniature painting, make sure you drop a comment and let me know what some of your favorite sculpts are and some of the different techniques you use. If you're attending ReaperCon at any point in time, make sure to keep an eye out. I will be at ReaperCon. We'll be presenting a couple of classes as well as doing some of the youth classes for beginner and intermediate miniature painting for youth. Also looking forward to that. I love seeing the hobby grow. Currently we are working on so many different models from Bones 5. It's such a great assortment and so much to be able to do. It's a fantastic Kickstarter if you got in on it. Um, I hope you enjoy it as much as I have so far. I really thought the sculpts that I have been able to work on are great. Aside from things like this Hydra, I did complete the Storm Giant and working on both Sophie's Revenge, the extremely large pirate ship, as well as one of the dragons, which is also a massive sculpt, a blue dragon. 
don't know if we're gonna get to post any of that or not. We'll see as time goes on how much time we actually get to record while we're painting, as well as editing, adding in some music just so it's a little more enjoyable, and getting it posted up on YouTube. So we will see. If you enjoy it, make sure to give a thumbs up, and that helps us grow, of course, and know what content people are most excited to see really gives us an indication of what type of content to continue to produce as we approach ReaperCon there's going to be a little bit more challenging in getting some of the content recorded and uploaded on a regular schedule but we are definitely going to try our best of course if you're a subscriber for the channel thank you very much definitely appreciate it. I hope that the channel gives you some enjoyment. And like I said, even if you just play some of the painting videos for some background noise, I definitely appreciate it. It makes me feel like nothing's going to waste. And this video, definitely different from ones we've done in the past just because this is just about painting. So I actually am not going to narrate the entire video. I'll turn it over to just some good painting content with what I feel is some pretty decent music to help you relax after a hectic day or get through your work day faster just with some Good painting vibes.
and you can see we've just got a lot of green on there starting to do the belly and an off-white with green but for this recording that's about all we're going to get done tonight but we'll keep working on this and watch our instagram for posts be sure to check out our twitch on tuesdays and to keep coming back here for more good content on miniature painting and rpg discussions we'll make sure to keep you full on all the content you can handle have a great evening